all right guys what's going on welcome back to the return to teenage mutant ninja turtles shredder's revenge today august 31st been counting down the days finally released the shell shock dimension dlc so that means new characters new like all types of new basically artwork and development in the levels i think there's like a new survival mode or something like that going on too so we are going to check out we're just going to jump into the arcade mode and check it out we are pretty decked out here we got our ninja turtles hat michelangelo and our mug for some tea so let's get right into it man it's gonna be a little, might be a little rough because it's been a little while Select since we have gone into this, but we just, it, so the DLC is an add-on. So it was like $7.99. It was on sale for $7.19 since, um, I think it was a PS Plus thing since it just came out. So, but they do have it as a bundle for $29.99. If you don't own Shredder's Revenge, you can get the full bundle for that price. So we unlocked April after completing the story mode um, and Casey Jones. And there's Usagi, I believe is how you say it. And then Karai, I think is how you say it. I'm not too sure. I'm not familiar with her, so I don't know if she is... I thought somebody said she was maybe in the comics. Um, I don't recall her in the 90s cartoon, but um, you can see the difference there. It looks like she has more power than Usagi, but has less speed. Range is the same. So, I am eager, have been very excited to try in Usagi. So. Oh, and you can change the colors. Oh my gosh. Oh, dude, that looks like the OG Game Boy. That's what that looks like with that coloring right there was like the black and white that we had on the Game Boy. I'm gonna go regular, so. Kinda see what this is like. So I think this is all pretty much the same. I'm gonna link in the description my previous playthroughs. I went through the story mode just as Leonardo. He's my favorite. Um, so I'll probably skip this. Just so we can dive in and see the characters. So. Job breaking news. But I also want to find out where it is because there's black and white <laughs> backgrounds in the games. They even, I don't what think they had it before. Castle. Even with the turtles, they have them as black and white. And I think their signature red, where they all used to have red in the comics. Dang it, Adam knows what I'm talking about. So. I must focus. Dude, I'm not even super familiar with Usagi. And again, I may be saying that wrong pronunciation. I don't know. Oh my gosh, we almost had no damage. But we got kind of ganged up on there, so. Man, this game is epic. Oh gosh, I missed it. I missed it. Didn't catch it soon enough. Power attack. Oh yeah, slap him. Go! Oh, frick. Dang. Okay. Speaking of Game Boy, they're playing their Game Boy right there. Dude, man, beat em ups grew up on the Streets of Rage, obviously. Um, bad dudes, I still need to play that on my. Nope. Oh, man. Okay. There we go. Okay. Super attack is ready. Mm. 
Man, they just, they did such a fantastic part on this, on this game. It has a part. It has a job all around. And I just watched a trailer. They have a G.I. Joe. Oh, I can't remember what it's called now. It has uh, Cobra's in the title. They have a G.I. Joe beat em up coming out in 2024. I'm excited. And then we also have... Get your spoon out of here. Okay. I was trying to grab him, but... And then also, I think later this year, we have the Toxic Avenger, which I never got to play, like the original as a kid, but the art style looks just like this, with that pizza going. So I'm excited to try... That's how to get ready. Okay. Okay, so dodge, roll, get behind him, and then you're good. <laughs> oh, man. I love it, dude. I love it. So great. That's going to fall. Nice. Oh, my gosh. There was no way to dodge that. Okay. Oh, shoot, man. Why do they just appear out of thin air? So yeah, this arcade mode plays, it, I think it said how it, how it said it, I think plays like the original. Oh, I missed that one. Um, also, I have a video coming. Adam and I went to... Gosh, dude. Adam and I went to a couple comic shops recently, and I didn't know that Usagi... Maybe it's Usagi, I don't know. Y'all have to correct me in the uh, comments. Oh my gosh, dude, what the heck? Alright, at least there's a pizza here. It took way too long trying to, like, get behind him. I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready. Oh man. Sign of time. Get ready for war, what hog? Ah, oh, shoot. Can't do it on your own, so you got to bring in people, I guess. Oh, shoot. Ooh, baby. Okay, so the good news is you can actually dodge his rolls. Or his charges with a roll. But you can't dodge that. Oh, okay. So yeah, you don't want to... Uh, let's just get him going here, maybe. Oh, you can't dodge the lasers. Okay. Oh, gosh. There we go. Okay. It is done. Excellent. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. That makes me want to play Ghost of Tsushima. Cowabunga! <laughs> you snooze, you lose, toitles. Those toitles. So yeah, we have a video coming with Big Apple, 3 PM. our comic adventures, and Usagi has his own comic line. I had no idea. 
<laughs> Make way for the samurai. Okay, so now I want to check out. Shaking effects. Flick sprint. So let me see. Fight the master. Collecting five dimensional crystals. All right, let's Select see. Select your hero. I haven't even tried anybody else besides Leonardo now and Usagi. Meet so let's the true leader of the foot. Check out Karai. Again, I might be saying that wrong. Her original with the purple looks really cool, so I think I'm going to keep that. He's getting pizza cheese all up in his mask. After yet another adventure with the turtles. What the shell? <laughs> Use them to zap across. Shredder's grabbing all of them. If you don't stop that tin plated tyrant. Fighting Shredders is what turtles, us turtles, do. Traveling to Edo Dimension. Okay, so yeah, this looks like what some of the new stuff is. Yes, okay. I want to play as him, dude. He looks awesome. Okay, that was not a good start. What the heck, man? Wow. Okay. I need to focus. Dang, dude. They're uh. You really can't like jump up and hit him. That's kind of weird. Oh. We're supposed to be collecting those. Goodness sakes. I don't know if there's uh, continues in this necessarily. I feel like maybe there hopefully would, but I don't know. Oh, let me get this one. No match for me. We missed it. There we go. Oh. A sushi plate appears for every 10 successive combo hits. Delicious. Last three rounds. Lasts for three rounds. Oh, there's a fox and raccoons. Quite delicious. Yeah, that's kind of weird. Like, you can't really get any hits in when you jump at them. Oh, all right. You can fall off the bridge. Wow. Give me my food. Quite delicious. Quite delicious. You were no match for me. I didn't see any. Uh... I'm gonna go for some health, I guess, on that one. I didn't see any ruby shards on that. Oh my gosh. You oh my gosh. Alright, let's check her special. Oh my gosh. Quite delicious. I'm not super fond of her playstyle. Okay. I mean, that's legit. Oh, gosh. You were no 
match ah, for me. I missed the short again, man. There we go. Okay, you can still grab him. Uh, I guess we'll go over here. Oh, wow. Okay, now we get to play as uh, the big boys. Oh, we got to try the uh, special on this. Oh, nice, dude. No, you lose, That's pretty legit. You get to actually play as some of the enemies. Times 20. Okay, cool. So I guess that's how you're going to reach 50. Dude, I need some health like mad. Oh my gosh, dude. Look at this Mauser. Oh gosh. We are low on health, man. I need you something. No, you lose, titles. Times 20. Let's get it, man. Oh, we're too off and we have no health. Unless di I wonder if it's going to switch us to Karai maybe after. I know I'm saying that wrong. Oh gosh, I hate these things so much. Oh, there it is. Okay. She's definitely more agile, which I like. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. There we go. All right. Hi. You were no match for me. She definitely has some cool moves, but I'm not sure. Um, okay. I guess you can score over, but crystal complete. Challenge increased. Mirage. Okay. So you get to go to different like dimensions and see all the different types of, I guess, different worlds. Okay. Nice. Here's the comic look. That's awesome, dude. That is so cool. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Okay, I was trying to kick him off the bike, but that didn't work out at all. Dude, come on, man. There we go. You gotta get them before they do the wheelie. Nope. Get out of here. You were no match for me. All right, let's see what's next. That was a good boost, actually. That gave us almost the sixty. Nope. Dang it. Okay. Oh. Okay, well, I mean, that was cool to see. Obviously, there's 
six different crystals, different dimensions you get to go to, so that's pretty cool. So this would be a good one to team up with some of the buddies and kind of go from Teenage there. Mutant, let's kick some shell. So that is kind of the basic rundown. So that's really awesome. Again, you got the story mode. You can do a new game. Keep power levels to reset your story progression, but keep your character's power levels. I don't know. It's always that thing. It's like, do you really want to? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. If you keep the power levels, you can use anybody else. So, um, and you have all the different settings there for Select your hero. easy, medium, hard. So... Okay, so now let's look at this. We'll, we'll, well, what are we waiting This was Adam's for? favorite from the recent movie, Mutant Mayhem. If you haven't seen it, that was actually really a fun time. Oh, there's the whiteout eyes on that one. The red eyes. He's got a different headpiece on there. And there's the Game Boy look. So I thought they had... This is April O'Neil, reporting <laughs> live. Yeah, it's really cool how they did all those. We must stop them. Let's bust some crime. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. So yeah, that's really cool. Again, super awesome. Again, it was like eight bucks for this DLC if you already own the game. If you don't own the game, you can buy the whole bundle for thirty. Um, actually, which is probably the best deal because I think the regular game of Shredder's Revenge not on sale is like twenty four ninety nine, so um, definitely worth it. This game was awesome. Again, I'll put a link in the description to my original gameplay of this. I, again, I played as Leonardo, Turtles, so let's get our shells and gear. He was oh, he's got like a face paint on that one. That's really cool. Mondo Notion, dude. Might as well check them all at this rate. So what now, fearless leader? That almost sounds like the original Raphael. I don't know if they did use him or not on this, but that's pretty cool. Again, watch the trailer for the Shellshock Dimension because they do in there somewhere, they have the turtles. I'm pretty sure, I don't think I was losing it. I'm pretty sure I saw them as black and white looking like the comic, like the level we saw, and they had red, like the red accents of their eye masks and all that. So, um, so yeah, I, it doesn't look like you can select them. Maybe it's when you're playing in that dimension that all of a sudden, you know, you have that look to you. So, so anyways, that is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge. I didn't know they were going to say it all for me right there. Shell Shock Dimension add-on. So there you go, guys. Much love to y'all. Hope y'all are doing well. Um, we also have the start of Dying Light, the first one. I've been wanting to play that for a while for my channel. Also going to be doing more of The Last of Us. Trying to fit them in where I can with my schedule. So appreciate y'all. Much love to you. Make sure to flex all over that like button. And we'll see you guys in the next playthrough. God bless y'all. Keep on rocking and cowabunga.